is wanted to show you a mock-up of my Ryobi outboard motor and how it, it's actually set up. I've attached it to a couple lawn chairs just to kind of show you the components of the system that I, that I built. It's a do-it-yourself project. Came up with it a couple months ago. Idea popped in my head, hey, why not use all these old Ryobi tools and build an outboard motor out of it? So I did. So over here, we have a joystick and we've got a forward and reverse switch got a throttle trigger and if you move this left and right it'll turn the motor over here we've got the battery so all of this stuff here connects to the my inflatable pontoon raft but I just got it locked out out here so it's easier to walk around and show you over here we just have a bolt meter it shows you how much life you have left on the battery kind of hard to see in the Sun show you the steering so by turning this left and right you're pulling on these cables which in turn pulls on the back side of this motor and turns it left to right so let me go ahead and pull the trigger Okay, so I went ahead, filled up a bucket, show you what happens when we pull the trigger. See how much water this prop will push. So here we go. Start off a little slow, and I'll we'll speed it up. Yeah, it's got a lot of torque, moves a lot of water, and it's good for about three to four miles per hour on the inflatable raft, so. Not too shabby. So that's pretty much it for this uh, outboard motor intro. I'm just going to show it to you one more time here. The trigger mechanism. Battery. Voltmeter. Steering mechanism. 